greetings 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 today i'm gonna talk about a very shocking topic of what happened to me like uh, five years ago i remember i was in a college where i was studying then uh i went home to visit my mom uh to see my parents how they were doing but at home there was a, a kind of a meeting a family meeting when i went back uh to uh, an apartment where i was staying uh, at college uh i found something that was very shocking at the first time i was not aware of it or uh, what was happening but um at times goes on uh, because i used to use water in my house or uh, uh came i put already uh, two or uh, 20 liters of water in my in my apartment so what i heard was very shocking is that uh when i test that kind of water was uh testing like um a urine so i was shocked i was thinking maybe there is a, a problem in a pipe or of a tap or something else happened but uh the second day uh, i throw out that water but the second day it was very shocking when i i, I also tasted that water was uh, pure urine when i'm speaking about a pure urine it was not just uh it was like someone else is or urinated on my uh, just pee on my water so i asked my friend uh, i called my friend uh uh for assurance for me to be assured of what was uh was happening that water was smelling like urine that water was pure urine so it was very shocking for me it was very devastating at the time because i, I didn't know what was happening i didn't know that was it was a a witchcraft attack it was my first time to feel something like that or to see something like that with my naked eyes then my friend he confirmed he said this is a real this is not water this is a urine so that time i realized that there is a witchcraft that is uh, already or going on in my life or someone already cast a, a spell on me so that the water i use because uh, according to what i think i think that person he bewitched me so that i will smell like a urine maybe among the people when I go everywhere, there will be no one who will like me because of that kind of witchcraft. So that day I realized that uh, this is not normal. This is a spiritual attack. So I decided to pray for that kind of water. So when I pray for that water, then I put a new water. That time, and it never happened again. Then I realized that uh, this is a witchcraft attack. That is my testimony how I survived uh, witchcraft attack through uh, the prayer after I realized that there is witchcraft. You can also, I believe you can be free from it.